Where are the interns? They're with Dr. Cox. Apparently, he's mentoring them and talking to them and stuff. What? Okay, that's it. This right here is the get hit line. Cross it at your own risk. When do you turn nice? This is getting kind of old. Never, Leslie. He knows my name. I was just calling you by a random girl's name. Listen, please. I don't care about any of your problems. I have no answers for any of you. Uh, but my boyfriend is bi-curious, and he wants me to pick his lovers. I might have an answer for that. Ew. I mean, come on, children. What do you actually think is going to happen here? Do you think I'm going to take you and sit you down next to me and say, um, listen, uh, if you need anything, You've got my pager. Just know that I'm there for you always. Oh, my God. No, baby. No. Zip it. I am so gee darn pissed right now. I was okay when you kept me in an arm's length because everybody said, that's just Cox. That's how he operates. And I believed him. But now I walk in on this. This biracial love fest. You know what? I hate to do it, but I'm giving you back the pencil. That's right, the pencil you gave me on my third day of work. You handed it off to me like a, like a tiny yellow baton, like you were trying to say to me, JD, you are the new me. You, JD, are my mentee. You are my son. What pencil? Oh, that's perfect. That's perfect. You know what, take it. Maybe you can use it with Rex or Gloria or that guy. That guy's name is Leslie. <laughs> His name is Leslie. His name is Leslie. Your name is Leslie. All right. Good for you, Leslie. Jordan, you promised this would never happen. 